What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. So I just got back home from work and I'm a little bit exhausted, but I thought I'd just make this video anyway since I haven't put out anything in quite a bit. But today we're going to be talking about something a little bit different and that's going to be about wallets. I've recently been on the market for a new wallet for quite some time now, but I haven't really found the one that I kind of really, really wanted and the one that fit my needs the best. So something that I'm always looking for is something that one kind of looks nice and two has really good functionality and just something that can always be used on like a daily basis since I'm not trying to buy like multiple different wallets for different occasions. So the one I have right now is the Calvin Klein uh, card holder that I've recently talked about. Actually not recently, it was like a while ago, but on my everyday carry video, I did talk about this wallet and it does kind of everything I need to. And the two things I definitely also want to have in a wallet is the functionality to be able to put cards in here as well as a little bit of cash. I definitely don't carry a lot of cash at all. I'll probably have like one $20 bill or something like that. But mainly I'm using cards all the time or I'm on my phone using Apple Pay. So again, the main thing for me was to have a good looking and functional wallet. And that's why I'm pretty happy to announce that I'm working with a company called Exter. Exter is a smart wallet company that creates a bunch of leather tech wallets. They've created about two or three separate designs for their wallets right now. And what makes them really special is that you can pretty much just track them from anywhere in the world. And you can even do the opposite and track your phone with your wallet. So I'm super happy to be working with them for today's video. And I'm sure you guys are gonna like this too. So let's go upstairs to the studio or pretty much my bedroom. All right, so let's get right into the package itself. Uh, I got this yesterday, but I didn't wanna open it um, until I filmed this video. I got my scissors right here and I'm not gonna show you this other side because it has all of my information on it. I'm pretty excited about this too. I haven't really gotten any uh, wallets like this expensive. My previous wallet was only like 30 bucks or something from like Macy's. So um, I don't really spend too much money on like those types of things, but I'm super happy to have gotten this and let's see what we got here. All right, so we got three things right here. So these are the three things. This is the first extra wallet. Uh, I pretty much got two wallets. Um, this one is the Exter Parliament. I'm not sure if you can see the, that, that's pretty cool. They got like the logo going on right there. Uh, we have the Exter Parliament in the Napa black colorway. And then we have the Exter Secretary in the Jupiter green colorway. So I did ask them to send me two of their wallets just so I could test out different types and which one's gonna suit my knees better and to give you guys a better idea of which one you guys can get. So let's open up the Parliament first. Uh, this is probably their most popular uh, wallet, and I think this is the one I'm gonna be using on a daily basis. So let's get right into it. I'm just gonna cut it kind of from the side. There we go. Right. Let's get this plastic off. Then here we go. We have the extra wallet, or the Parliament box. I love that little logo it's kind of like embossed in there i think that's how you say it but um yep let's open this up it looks very nice this matte black box all right there we go we have the uh we get the wallet right there then we open it up below that it's just oh paper and the inside this is gonna be really hard for you guys to see because it's black on black but it says thank you for choosing us to improve your everyday carry to get started, please visit www.extra.com slash user manual. So that's pretty much what you should expect if you're buying an extra wallet. Uh, and let's get right into it. So let's just take this, I don't know, wax paper type of thing off. And then there we go. We have the wallet right there. And wow, this, the first thing that I notice when opening it up is the quality of this thing. Most smart tech wallets or anything like that are probably gonna be really bad quality since they're gonna focus more on the tech side of things rather than like how it looks and how it feels and the, I can tell like has amazing uh, quality to it. So opening up the wallet itself, it's like a bifold wallet and on the left side right here, you can put two cards right into these slots. And on the right side, you pretty much have this little strap right here that you can use for putting some cash in. 
And then for the main attraction of this wallet of how you actually get all your cards, it's pretty much this little lever right here that you push and all the cards come right out of this. So let's push this up right here. Oh wait, no, we don't push it up, we push it in. You have to push this in right here. And there we go, there's all the cards right there. Push it slowly and it kind of gives you not the biggest, you know, push of all your cards. Uh, you push it back in and we if we try to push it like a lot harder, like like that, then like your cards are gonna kind of like fly out of there. And that's a pretty good thing too, just because you can take the, um, the card at the end right out. So probably the most used card that you have, you're gonna put right at the end of all the cards. So pretty much for me, I always just use my credit card the most out of my wallet. So I'll be putting my credit card right in the back. So the biggest worry that I had for this wallet before getting it was the size. I'm pretty used to having a really minimal and small sized wallet. And this extra parliament is definitely a little bit thicker than the Calvin Klein card holder that I currently use. And I just want to make sure that there's not like a big wallet bulge in my pants or my pocket uh, whenever I have a wallet around. But I'm pretty sure that this one is actually just as slim uh, or a little bit thicker, of course, but it's not as thick as I thought. And I actually thought that the wallet would be a lot bigger in like in length. And I'm pretty happy that it's not that different from my card holder. Alright, so pretty much this is the extra parliament right here. And then this is my Calvin Klein card holder. So there's not much of a difference. It's probably like, I don't know what, maybe a little bit less than a half of an inch. And I thought it would be a lot or bigger and not as easy to carry. And which is also the reason why I asked them to send me over a card holder because I thought this one wouldn't be as portable and stuff. But this one is definitely great for carrying around every single day. And it's just a really good looking wallet. So that's pretty much it for the extra parliament wallet on how it looks and everything. Has a very soft touch, has a very high quality uh, build to it. And it definitely looks like something I'll be using on a daily basis. So let's put that down and open up the extra card holder that they have, which is called the secretary. And this time I didn't get black, like I usually get everything in black, but I got this in Jupiter green, which I'm very excited about. So let's open this up. All right, there we go. Take this plastic off. Oh, there we go. And yes, again, we have this nice matte black box with the extra wallet embossed. Kind of when you see these types of boxes, you already know that they're gonna be super high quality. And I'm super excited about this. Let's get right into it. Let's take this extra thing off. And we have paper. Then bam, we have the extra card holder, the uh, secretary. I keep forgetting that, but the secretary in Jupiter Green. And wow, this is also very well made. So the thing I was really looking for in a card holder is for, you know, to be able to fit cards, of course, but also for that little middle gap. Um, if you guys don't know, but like you could just put like cash right into there. Even if you don't use cash often, like you could always have one 20 or $50 bill in there just in case for emergencies. So I think that this uh, extra card holder, the secretary is really good if you just want something for an everyday carry. Since the other one is a little bit more bulky, I think you can still carry it around every single day. But I think that this card holder is really good just because it doesn't have as much of a bulge or it doesn't get uh, as thick as the other one. They both look super classy and super nice. And honestly, if you're going out on like a date or if you're just going out on a business trip, something like that, these look super professional and like people are going to take you a lot more seriously if you have one like really nice wallet like these extra ones right here. So that's pretty much it for the wallets themselves. Uh, let's get more into the tech side of things and talk about the extra uh, tracker card that we have right here. So getting right into it, we pretty much just open it like this. I'm not opening it correctly just because it wasn't opening before. I don't know how this works. Okay, so there we go. We're pretty much just tearing this entire thing apart. I'm sorry, extra. I didn't want to do this, but this was just a little bit too hard to open. But opening it up, we have this little iPod looking thing. We just pull it out and... That's about it. Again, it says thank you for choosing us to improve your everyday carry inside. Nice little note. And what this iPod looking thing actually does is that it's like about the size or smaller than an actual card. And you pretty much just put it inside the wallet that you have. So for example, if you have the Jupiter wallet and you wanna put this uh, tracker device inside your wallet, all you have to do is just slide it into any one of these um, card holder slots. And there you go. It adds a very, very slight bulk to it. But honestly, it's very worth it because if you ever lose your wallet, you can always find it with the Chipolo app. So if you look right on the back of the uh, extra 
tracker device. You can just see a QR code right there that you can just scan and then it'll pretty much just find your wallet. So for example, if you go out some night and you do lose your wallet, but you do have the tracker card inside of your wallet and somebody picks it up and they do happen to take a picture of this QR code right on the back of this tracker, um, they're gonna be able to see the name of the person and all the information that they need to bring it back to you. So I think that's really awesome, but I don't think that's practical enough for people to just look inside your wallet pull out this little thing, go to the back of it, and take a picture of this QR code. Doesn't really seem very practical to me, but that doesn't really matter because that's one of the many features that this tracker device has. So another thing that this can do is that if it's inside your wallet and you do have your phone around, you can just install the Chipolo app and then click on find my wallet and then it's gonna start sending a ring sound from the tracker card itself. So pretend like you lost your wallet under your couch, you can just use this app and it's gonna ring right under your couch and you're gonna be able to find your wallet. And that I think is a really amazing feature and I'm really happy to have Exter be the first ones uh, making smart wallets and this thing is really going to help me out a lot. And taking a look at the parliament wallet, we can just take this tracker card, pretty much that there's also a card holder slot uh, right in the back of the wallet so I think this is actually how they advertise it as well just because it makes the most sense. So you can just go to the back of the wallet, see that slot, you can just push it right in there. And again, it has very nice snug fit to it, so you don't even realize it's really there. Adds a very, very small amount of bulk to the wallet itself, but nothing really too noticeable, and it's going to help you out a lot in the long run. So that's pretty much it for this video. Um, I'm really going to be enjoying these extra wallets, the uh, Jupiter in green, and this Parliament in the black colorway. I'm going to be using them both a lot, and... I'm super happy about this extra tracker card too. I'm gonna be throwing this in my wallet or my backpack or something like that. And I hope to have a really good experience. I'm sure it's gonna be amazing. And another thing I wanna tell you guys is that if you go down below, you're gonna see that 10% off for your own extra wallet. So definitely if you're looking for a wallet to pick up and you're into tech at all, or if you just want something really safe and something you could rely on, make sure to pick up one of these extra wallets and I'm sure you're gonna be really happy with it. So if you're looking for more of an all-in-one wallet, I definitely recommend picking up the Parliament wallet. And if you're looking for something with more of a slimmer and minimalistic design, I'd definitely pick up the Jupiter wallet in whatever color you want. I think there's up to seven colors that you can pick from. So there's so many options for you guys, and I'll definitely go check out that link right in the description below for your 10% off. So thank you guys for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, tell me what you guys think of this wallet down in the description below, and I'll be happy to read them and respond to all of you guys. Thank you guys again for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.